Hello and welcome everybody to my new video and it's official now. It's holiday season and we're gonna meet our family. This brings a lot of old wounds, old issues with it and I guess we all at one point have to deal with some undissolved family trauma or any kind of theme that is still hidden under the carpet. We're living in a time now where there's no hiding underneath the closet anymore. It's not possible. So we better deal with it right away. And in this video I would like to introduce to you a few simple methods how to prepare to meet your family. At first you have to remind yourself that you have to own your own feelings. Everything that you see in your family members is actually something that you still did not do not love about yourself or haven't made peace with. And I would like to invite you to come to that place of completely self-love and self-acceptance. How you can do that, I'm going to show you. I first would like to introduce you to a short method how to open up your heart space and to remove the pain that is stored in your heart. So you want to make a fist out of your left hand and take your knuckles and really press them hard into that place where the sternum meets the rib cage, and find and rub that place and find it and it might be very painful in the beginning. Every negative thought you have, any thought of resentment and negativity, it's all stored in the bones and over the bones it's gonna have a feedback to loop to your mind so be aware of your thoughts. We want to rub that space. You can also put your right hand on top and you really put some pressure and with the intention to really dissolve that old garbage, that old wound, it's time to let that go, to open the heart space and to align ourselves with the divine love that's inside of us. So do that for a few minutes. Breathe deeply into it, really press hard. And you already might find some relief and just notice what's coming up. And then just let sink down your hands and just notice what you feel. Notice the difference. We want to open up the heart space. It's a very simple method to release trauma that is stored in the tissues, in the bones, in the body. Another perfect method is to meditate before you meet your family. I highly encourage you, this is a time where we withdraw, where we go within and reflect on ourselves. Use your intuition and set a vision how you want this family meeting to unfold. In the moment you don't react anymore, you don't go into conflict, you own your feelings, you get the power back into your own hands and then you can deal with everything that's coming your way. If you meditate, you close your eyes and you simply repeat to yourself, I am love. I am love. I am deeply loved and supported. I deeply and truly love and accept myself just the way I am. No matter what anybody might think about me, I deeply and truly love and accept myself as I am. Whatever message self-nourishing, self-supporting message comes into your mind, you can repeat and envision that meeting 
and you have it all in your hands, if you set the intention, if you have that feeling already to make it an unforgettable memory, beautiful memory, you always want to have wonderful, create wonderful and beautiful memories. And that's unfolding a new karma, a positive karma for yourself and your loved ones. So that's a method, go into deep meditation, repeat some self nourishing and supporting messages with the I am. It's very powerful and it works. It needs a little bit of training, but it definitely works. And the last method I would like to introduce to you is if the going gets really tough and if there's really some heavy conflicts coming up, you just withdraw, you just go outside of the door, have a have a round, have a, a little walk or do some exercise or whatever. Maybe you use the bathroom, go to the bathroom and you can just put your hands underneath your armpits. This is the place where the lymphatic system and the nervous system meets that has a very calming and self-supporting effect. You have a little pressure underneath your arms, you deeply breathe in, raise your shoulders up press a little bit under the armpits and with the out breath you let it all go. Take a deep breath in, press and let go with the out breath and do that as long as you need to get centered again, to get your self-esteem, your self-confidence back and to release any kind of emotional trigger you might have been tapped into. We have to understand that everything we see in our family members is only a mirror for something that we still need to do a little bit of work at. So instead of avoiding any family meeting, I invite you to go there and see it as a little training of how much spiritually evolved you are, you're going to be amazed how beautiful and how positive this Christmas can unfold in a spirit of love, acceptance, compassion for each other and really a deep interest. And maybe you're going to be the first one who wants to listen and not complain about not being listened to. You can be the one who's going to make the change and it's going to be a beautiful and wonderful Christmas 2019 that you always will remember. I hope this was helpful for you and I'm wishing you beautiful days, wonderful days filled with love, compassion with your loved ones and I wish you a Merry Christmas. Thank you very much.